One of the issues that I face in my house with so many devices attempting to connect to the internet is capacity. Your standard wireless access point in your house may can support up to 10 devices and that's being generous. Now we are having more and more IoT devices that integrate into our homes and our daily lives that need internet access. Which brings us to Wi-Fi 6. We'll be talking more about this at the end of the video, but please stay tuned because I have a huge announcement from Cisco, the sponsors of these videos. Stay tuned. So we're doing 24 hours with no Wi-Fi, no cellular, and no data, and no internet access whatsoever. I can't remember the last time I've done this. I think the last time I've done this, I had a flip phone, hold on. Yeah, it was a long, long time ago. <laughs> Yeah, the last time I done this, I had a flip phone. Can I see? Yeah. Mm. You've never seen one of those before, have you? No. <laughs> but no, only on TV. Only on TV. We're in a whole new day and age. So what we're gonna do now is disconnect the wireless access in my house. So everybody's gonna do this with me. We are in a different day and age than when I came into IT in the year 2000. Back then, everything was connected on the land. We had just transitioned from the ring and bus topology to these hybrid mesh networks that we have today. And the dynamics are getting even more complicated when you think of IoT. Just as we walk throughout my house in this short period of time, you see my TV won't connect, the phone won't connect, my heating and control system won't connect, my alarm system won't connect. So many different devices that we use daily will be affected if we didn't have the internet or wireless capabilities. It's the next day. I'm getting my stuff ready so I can get to work. Let's see how this works out. Um, wasn't able to check my email. I had to write my first check that I wrote in a long time so I could mail it out. What else? All right, what sucks is that normally what I would do is listen to an audio book. I got like a 45 minute drive to work and Audiobooks has really been something that's not only educational, but it can be entertaining. And they pass time without me feeling like I'm just wasting, you know, what, an hour and a half of my day. You know what I mean? So I just arrived at my job. And I'm not going to have Wi-Fi for my personal stuff, but I need it for my job. Um, I work in the medical industry and the smallest amount of downtime that a hospital has connecting to their databases, their applications, or whatever could mean someone loses their life. And so every day that I can go to work as a network engineer, to me, I feel that I'm saving somebody's life. So. The internet, just at that standpoint, is very important in today's infrastructure and world as we stand because hospitals are truly embedded in technology. So another day in the office, knocked out. Now I'm headed to my daughter's soccer game. She's pretty good. I'm gonna see how she do today. Go Kayla. Oh, I like them stunner shades. Look at you. Thank you. You played an awesome game. You know that? Mm -hmm. Thank you. You got ice on? Ice? Yeah. What's that, ice? Yes. It's under my sweats, that's why. Damn. This one when you fell? Yeah. You that collision? Yeah. Ooh, good it wasn't even my fault, but the Russians game was ridiculous. Like, <laughs> I can't. Like, he wanted to call my, like, my throw in, like, off because, first of all, I did turn my head. Like, he... Because the past rest was like, as long as you turn your head, you're good. Yeah. But this rest was like, you have to turn your whole body. Like, what? That defeats the whole yeah. purpose of a trick throw. You try to get them no look Magic Johnson passes, huh? Yeah, and it worked almost. <laughs> Day in the life without Wi Fi. Could you imagine not having Wi Fi? I mean, yes. Yes? Yes. Yeah, because you lives without Wi Fi. <laughs> yeah. A little bit. Because I had like, I had games that didn't need Wi Fi. Yeah. And it's like, you always took me over somewhere in a house that had like kids. Yeah. 
and Ryan and Big Man never not had Wi-Fi. Right. That's crazy. I know. Shout out to my daughter. They won that game. She's awesome in like everything she does. And she's extremely smart. I'm truly blessed to have an amazing family and some great kids. Now I'm about to run into Walmart, get some gallons of water. So I'm gonna get this water. And go home and wrap up this day with no Wi-Fi. Oh, you think Walmart got Wi-Fi? Let me find out, let me ask somebody. Does Walmart have free Wi-Fi? Yes. It does? Yeah. That's awesome, thank you. You're welcome. Wow, so Walmart has free Wi-Fi. Looks like we're gonna be seeing Wi-Fi 6 in Walmart soon, huh? And that's been pretty much my day without Wi-Fi. Right now, I'm about to just cook this dinner. Brussels sprouts on deck. Um, yeah, get ready for tomorrow. And we're gonna talk about this latest Cisco announcement. The all new Catalyst 9120 wireless access point. These next generation APs deliver support for Wi-Fi 6, 802.11 AX technology. Today, many organizations are switching their standard user connectivity from wired to a more mobile one. Now, this is where Cisco plans to have a huge impact in the industry, and I'm really excited for this new technology. The new Catalyst 9120 access points makes a long overdue improvement in capacity for mobile devices. With the growth of IoT, it's all around us. Cisco is focused on user experience for high density networks that are resilient and secure. Not only are they intent based, but they also support IoT at scale. Let's be honest, we are now dependent on Wi-Fi more than ever. The Cisco Catalyst 9100 access points powered by Wi-Fi 6 and supporting Cisco's intent-based networking architecture are ready for the growing user expectations, IoT devices, and next-gen cloud-driven applications. So what are some of the features of this access point? The 9100 access points are high quality, meaning they give the user a reliable user experience. And lastly, they're intelligent. They offer superior RF innovations with real-time visibility and insight. Understand this, not only is technology evolving, but with IoT devices, it's expanding at a rapid rate. The new Cisco 9120 access points are ready for the performance and reliability that manufacturing industries, airports, stadiums, and hospitals need on a daily basis. I would like to thank Cisco for sponsoring this video, and I would like to thank you for viewing this video. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.